can surface water go into a rainwater harvesting tank? Okay, this is certainly a frequently asked question. Um, I generally have, um, again, mixed views on this. Um, I think it's a yes and no answer. So, again, I would generally encourage the customer to do a little bit more um, research into terms of why they want to collect the surface water. I mean, you would look to collect surface water if you um, didn't have the volume required um, from the roof every loan to supplement the applications you're looking to use the, the rainwater, stormwater for. Um, so firstly, do you have the rainwater available from the, the roof areas alone? If yes, you don't need to consider surface water. If you don't, you can consider surface water, but then you need to start needing to think about treating that surface water. Um, because surface water, whether this be um, potentially coming from a car park or someone's driveway, you're potentially going to have some some mixed fuels and oils potentially coming down those drainage pipes into the tank. And we don't really want that in our underground tank. Not only, of course, to be reused back into the property, but of course, if you're going to use it for irrigation, it's going to go onto your plants. We don't really want that. Um, of course, if you're looking at potentially collecting water from a pavement area from your back garden, you're probably going to be slightly safer because you're not going to have the, the oils and stuff from those vehicles channeling down into your tank. So, Again, what service are you collecting from? Is there going to be potential for stuff you want, not want going into your tank to come into your tank? Yeah. Um, so again, take a step back. Think about um, what is the surface going to be used for? Um, what, um, how much rainwater you need to potentially harvest before you then start thinking about putting surface water into your rainwater harvesting tank? So yeah, you can do it, but you need to be very careful about um, those two points. So please consider those before you um, start channeling um, your surface water into your rainwater harvesting system. But in general cases, it is usually the case that only roof areas are used for harvesting rainwater. We would generally encourage roof areas only. It's only when you need a requ the requirements for the additional surface water to come right through the rainwater harvesting technique that you potentially ever consider using that water. So, yeah.